Hello. Welcome back to Granny's Pad. Do you guys use that word anymore? Welcome to my pad. <laughs> Granny's Place, okay. So today is my uh, number two Indian food, but I will be doing two things at once. I was challenged by just Terry being me to do the, the eating for eight minutes without getting your lips, you know, eating, eating up all your lipstick. So my lips are really dark today. I put on extra lipstick. I usually don't wear lipstick. I just do lip liner and lip gloss, but today it's the lipstick challenge. So I put some lipstick on and it's eating anything you want and not getting, not eating up all your lipstick. Okay, but before we get started, this is my second Indian food experience and I decided to get the chicken tikka masala because everyone's talking about that. And the last time my first Indian food was butter chicken and that was good. So this time I decided to get chicken tikka masala. And there it is right there. And I brought, I mean, they give you a lot of food. I ordered one order for myself, but it was like, I think double this amount. And so I wanted to finish everything. So that's why I only brought, you know, I didn't unwrap everything you know in the video because I wanted to just have it all ready and be able to eat the whole plate and I don't even know what I really got so this time last time I got garlic naan this time I decided to get the butter naan and this is a let me see this is all new to me alotika no alotiki okay it's made of potato vegetables and then deep fried so that sounds really good and these chips, I forgot what they're called. You guys comment below. Indian viewers, tell me what these are. They look like healthy chips. And then I have the cucumbers. And I told them they are so, our local um, Indian restaurant, they are so kind. I didn't have any purple onions, so I was gonna order and then go to the store, rent to the store and get my you know, purple onions. And when I mentioned it to them, they gave this to me for free. It doesn't even go with the meal, but they gave it to me and saved me time. Thank you so much. And I know what these sauces are this time. This is turmeric. This is mint. So I'll be dipping all this goodness into there, okay? I've never tried this. I've never tried that. I never tried the butter naan, but I'm sure it's similar to the garlic naan without just buttery. And chicken tikka masala. But before I get started, oh, and mango lassi, okay? That's always good. And before I get started, remember last time I told you that I have neighbors, my friends that are Indian? I have quite a few. And my friend, she went to go visit home last year I think and she brought me this it's a Indian excuse me if I, I don't know the name in, in, in Indian but it's a you know it's a wrap and so the last time I had to run over there and ask her well how do you wear it so they're and they're the they're, I guess there are different um, Indian names for you know depending on where you live so I think they're from they're Punjab Punjabi Tell me which is correct. I'm sorry, I'm not really good at memorizing all that. So my friend showed me several ways you can wear this. Right now it's really hot, so I'm not gonna wear it. I'll just show you. You can just wrap it like this, or you can do this, like in the winter, you know? I would do this in the winter. And I think, wait, did you show me this one? I think you, you could do that. And then there's one that just goes over the shoulder, right? Like that. And I think that's about it. I think this is handmade. It's beautifully made with beads and things. So because it is so hot, it's very late at night and it's still very hot. So I'm not going to be wearing this. If it was winter, I would probably wear this and eat. And you know what? I'm going to continue ordering. I'm going to be eating. You know, I'll do a series on the Indian food. And until 
I eat everything here. <laughs> okay. So look forward to that. Let me wipe my hands. And many of you commented with my first Indian video. I ate with my hand. And many of you comment, you know, it's the tradition, but many of you commented that I don't need to be eating with my hand. So I will be eating with my wooden fork and spoon. Who knows, I might change my mind. And so I'm going to do the challenge as well. The challenge is eating for eight minutes and we can drink and all that. And it's not a speed eating uh, challenge. So that's why I like it. The challenge, uh, just Terry being me, she challenged me, but uh, the original creator of this challenge is Scent and Mo. So what you do is set the timer for eight minutes and it's not a speed eating, so I'm so glad. So I have eight minutes here and it's just eating for eight minutes and then seeing if you ate your lipstick off, you know. I think it's pretty easy, don't you think? It's doable. This time, I think I have confidence. I think I can do it. Eight minutes, okay. So, dear God, we thank you for this meal. Help it to nourish my body. We thank you for everything that you have given us. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. All right. Chicken tikka masala. I've never had this before. I love recording my first you know, taste in anything that I eat. Is it similar to butter chicken? If it is, I'll like it. Okay, let me set the time. Trying to do organize two different things at once is hard. Okay. It's not speed. I don't have to finish the food. Mm. I knew I would like it. After that first try, I think this has a stronger taste, more spices. They asked me, what level of spice do you want? And like a chicken, I said, give me the mildest. But I think next time I, I'll move it up a little because I already eat, you know, the two times nuclear sauce. Mm. I forgot about my lips. Mm. This is mango lassi. This is my third time having lassi. <gasps> and this is... Mm. What is this? This is... Alo tiki, the potato. It's made of potatoes with other vegetables and then and then it's deep fried. And I asked them, I didn't wanna, you know, I wanted to eat the food properly, so I asked the restaurant people, what do I dip it in? And they said I could dip any of this into the sauces, the mint and the turmeric. Turmeric? Tamarin? Tamarin? So it looks like, here, there's your first bite, okay. Oops. <laughs> Let me dip it in here. Mm. Mm. Crispy on the outside. Smooth on the inside. And is it coriander that I taste? I think it said coriander. Mm. There's a spice in here that I'm not familiar with, but as long as it's not cilantro. Mm. Onions. These are some sort of chips, people. What is this? They told me, but I forgot. <laughs> I 
this mint, I smell cilantro. I like cilantro. I like cilantro. I like cilantro. I wonder what the black seeds are in there. Maybe flax seed? Tell me, comment below. Thank you, um, Indian viewers. You gave me so much feedback on the first video. You, edu you gave me a lot of education on the food and on the culture. Thank you so much. So tell me what this is made of. Are, are those flax seeds? Okay, butter naan. I was about to dip it in the bin and I thought of cilantro. <laughs> this tamarind, tumarind, tamarind, it's so sweet. It's like a barbecue sauce. <laughs> not even a challenge. I will like cilantro. I will. I will like cilantro. Cilantro is yummy. It is yummy. It is yummy. I think YouTube is going to change my life. I see you guys eating this and it looks so good. So the only thing that I kind of have a little issue with is I think the cilantro that's in there. There might not be, but it smells like cilantro. Mint and cilantro. I'm almost up. What the? My lips are all there. Maybe I should have had a hamburger or something, huh? These are kind of salty and So I will be doing more Indian food until I finish the whole menu, I think. What do you recommend I eat next? I've had butter chicken. I've had chicken tikka masala. What should I have next? Comment below.
Maybe I was supposed to eat food like this. Right? For the challenge. Because for us women, when we eat, we eat up our lipstick. And so sometimes when you see me do the edit and then I cover and then I'm doing something right, I'm actually drying my lips because I ate up on my lipstick. By the end of this video, I think I will like this. I will like it, I will like it. Mm. Chicken masala, chicken tikka masala. It's good. Everything that I've tried so far, is good lots of carbs though I think the amount of food that the restaurant the local restaurant gives us it'll feed two people because there's more left behind than what I brought up here that's a lot of food the restaurant people I'll be back <laughs> I'll be back these what do you call them chips or I don't know they only give this to you when you eat there and I was surprised to find people eating there outside so I guess in our city you could eat outside they gave these to me, five of them. Thank you so much. The restaurant is called Turmeric. Thank you, Turmeric. I will be back over and over. And the last time I had so much fun eating with my hand, Although I had the, the curry, the smell for like two days. But some of you said, oh, you know, you have to eat with your hand. Some of you said, oh, you can eat with your fork. You know what? I want to please both of you, okay? I'll do both. to this <laughs> oh no I bet you my siblings are going to get surprised because they would have never thought that I would be eating Indian food. Surprise. <laughs> I should have eaten like this for the challenge.
I'll just count this whole meal time as a challenge, okay? After I finish eating this, I'll see if I have any lipstick remaining. These are kind of really salty. Um, salty and a little bitter. There's a certain way you eat it. You form the rice, and then I I think I heard someone saying you have to use the thumb to scoop it in, right? And the chicken's very flavorful. This granny's going somewhere, huh? In all my some years of life, I've, I can't believe I've, I've never tried Indian food. I've lived half of my life already, or a little more. There's a saying, you learn till you die. What should I eat on my third meal, third Indian meal? Comment below. But no, no lamb, okay? I, I can't do lamb meat. I've tried lamb before, I can't eat it. So anything but lamb, okay? I'm getting full. I like eating with my hand better than the fork. I think I beat the challenge. I think my lipstick's still there, right? So, since I 
beat the challenge. I have to nominate three more people, three people to do this. And you can eat whatever food you want. I challenge. Who wears lipstick? I have to think of people who wear lipstick. Okay, Mrs. Brown from We Are The Browns. I challenge you, Jess, Jessica, can I say your name? Jess, I challenge you. Okay, wear red lipstick and eat a full meal or eight, eight minutes of it without eating up your lipstick, okay? And I challenge. Tata ASMR. Eat for eight minutes without eating up your lipstick, okay? One more person who wears lipstick. <coughs> hippo. Hungry hippo ASMR. I challenge you to this no eating lipstick meal, okay? I just finished this. I'm so full. And it's past like nine o'clock. I think it's 9.30. I'm going to eat this tomorrow. If I overeat, I'll get nauseous. Mm. I'm going to eat that tomorrow. I'll finish this. So much food. And it's all the carbs that's just expanding in your stomach, so I'm getting really full. Butter chicken good. Chicken tikka masala is good. Everything is good. It's good. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you, and subscribe if you haven't. Okay. And I will continue doing the series of Indian food because you guys like it so much until I eat the whole menu here. <laughs> okay. All right. Thank you so much. And I will see you tomorrow. Until next time. God bless you. Take care and eat food, okay? Appreciate, you know, all the things that God has given you and enjoy your food. All right. And don't eat so late at night. Don't do what Granny does. <laughs> all right. Thank you. Thank you for coming and watching.